Hey guys, it's ShaderYT, and in part 2 of this video, before we really get into any of this stuff, I'd just like to explain to you a quick, brief history of this server. So the server started in 2018, being run by a player named Maxi, and some contributions made by a player named Lord Liam 8 and has since been the center of much controversy regarding Minecraft Bedrock Anarchy servers. Due to the abuse coming from the server owner, Maxi, Lord Liam began to become suspicious of the server and began to have some concerns, which led to Maxi eventually abandoning 2B2T MCPE later on, which led to Lord Liam making some changes in resetting the map. Obviously, this is 2B2T PE, so this is way different than 2B2T MCPE, but surprisingly enough, this is run by the same people, which means I want to get into my next point with my next point with this is that after 2B2T MCBE was reset by Lord Liam after Maxi stepped down, another player going by the name of Master Luke set up another server on the Infinite Games Network, 2B2T PE, which is the server I'm playing on right now. But what's funny enough is that if you look on the 2B2T PE Discord, there are, there's evidence of Maxi joining the server in its early stages and getting kicked over and over and over again but rejoining, which is suggesting to me that Maxi had some sort of exploit or external and internal access to the server. Or did he? Because ladies and gentlemen, get ready to meet Lord Liam 8 and Maxi 115. So we are going to be starting with a screenshot that I got from Maxi about 2B2T MCPE. And what I asked him was, why do you no longer own 2B2T MCPE? And he replied with, because we switched strategy. On behalf of CubeMC LLC, I cannot reveal business secrets. I continued to hammer him on this question, but he seemed reluctant to answer me. So I asked other questions. I asked him, why did you keep leaving and joining the 2B2T PE Discord? And he says, I sometimes get tagged by people and it gets annoying. But what that does not explain is him rejoining dozens of times. If he can leave the 2B2T PE Discord just like that, he should stay gone. Why would he continue rejoining in the year of 2019 multiple times? But before we move on to Lord Liam 8, I'd like to share a couple of the key points in my conversation that explain a little why Maxi was a tad bit reluctant to explain or share anything. The first of the two screenshots I would like to show you guys is this screenshot. He says, All I can tell you is our business's main focus is no longer anarchy. Anarchtype is only a side project. Which means his hosting company, CubeMC, is up to some devious crap. Because from what I've heard, host server hosting doesn't need to be that secretive. People can know about your company. And honestly, anarchy servers in the queue, that can make you a lot of money. So, I am a little confused on why he was so secretive about what the main focus of his business was. The final screenshot for Maxi115 before we move on to Lord Liam 8 is this. Isn't this a very interesting screenshot? Well, first of all, I have to explain why this screenshot is interesting. Start with my question. Explain him nuking and attacking the 2B2T MCPE Discord. On the internet, all the wikis and blogs say that Lord Liam attacked the 2B2T MCPE Discord after he was given ownership of the server. But Maxi responds with, he didn't nuke the Discord. Well then, if he didn't nuke the Discord, who did? Apparently, Maxi doesn't even know. Okay, now we're gonna move on to Lord Liam 8. And we're gonna start with where he and Maxi115 met, 2B2T Pocket. And according to Lord Liam 8, it was decently popular on YouTube in around 2017 and ended shortly after 2017. After they stopped playing 2B2T Pocket, they started 2B2T MCPE, Maxi starting it first and Lord Liam 8 making some contributions. But before I move into the actual drama that went down on 2B2T MCPE, let's look at this screenshot really quick. Lord Liam is saying, that he convinced Maxi115 to pay for 2B2T MCP.org for a month in March in 2018. Which makes no sense, because Maxi started the server. Who's paying for it? Lord Liam? Or some other person in this equation? But regardless of all of that, this is one of the most interesting screenshots I've seen throughout the entire Discord conversation. If you're confused with the context of the situation, let me tell you what the question was. 
I asked, what are your relations with Master Luke, the man who started 2B2TPE and hosted it on IGN, Infinite Games Network? And he responds with this. He played on 2B2T MCPE with friend Dirty Frog, which is a player on the server. He got Mad Max abused and made his own server, just like the wiki says. He was in a secret group, P Chang, with me and Max. He had Zoo Op. Zoo, I'm not really able to know what that means, but I do understand Op due to some later screenshots in the conversation I'm about to show you. So before I show you the screenshot, I would just like to give you some context. This op group essentially means they all had operator and they were OP players that were abusing the server. Like, Max, you own the server. Why are you abusing it? And they were duping kits and they had their own little anarchy group going, PCHAG. But anyways, all of that out of the way, I would like to show you this next screenshot, which is extremely disturbing. Now you're probably wondering, why is this screenshot disturbing? So let me give you some context information. Wikis have said that Max abused the server and Lord Liam was uncomfortable talking about it. I didn't believe that until actually hearing it from Lord Liam himself. Later on, he went to contradict that exactly like the wiki says. Which means that not everything in that wiki was absolute garbage. But why would Maxi get mad over something that happened three years ago in a block game? So guys, thank you so much for watching, and in next video, I'm gonna give all the context that I received from Lord Liam on the history of exploits on the server and Maxi's involvement with it. It's extremely interesting. I'm in the process of editing it, editing it right now. I hope you guys go and watch it when it's public. Anyways, guys, see you. Bye. Don't forget to like and subscribe.